Hello friend my name is Dr. Puru Dawan and today in this video I will explain how GFR can be increased in a patient of kidney failure. Before explaining GFR, it's very important to understand kidney failure. Kidney failure is a condition where levels of creatinine increases because kidney is losing its function, basically it is not properly excreting out creatinine from the body. As we all know kidney is getting damage mainly from high blood pressure or diabetes. Because this continuous damage to kidney by high BP and sugar condition keeps increasing. It further results in increased levels of creatinine and urea even after taking medicines. So, if a patient wants to increase GFR. Firstly, we have to work on the main cause of kidney failure one has to bring blood pressure and diabetes in control. So that no more damage happens to kidney and no elevation of creatinine and urea happens. This will help patient to stop degradation of GFR. Now you must be confused regarding relationship between creatinine and GFR. Then let me explain this to you. GFR is mathematical calculation based on creatinine and your age. Now you can see a formula on your screen. I know it's tough to understand, let me make easier for you. Search GFR calculator on Google, now open any site, my personal favorite is Davida. Enter your creatinine value and your age, click calculate. Now I hope GFR value it is showing here is same as your report. That means that. To increase our GFR we have to bring creatinine levels down. To decrease creatinine we have to work on kidney functions as the function of the kidney increases the level of creatinine decreases. Now question arises, does the kidney have ability to increase its functions? Let's take it with an example if a person loses his one kidney because of sepsis or accident, even after losing one kidney the level of kidney doesn't increases the reason is that other kidney increase its functions that mean kidney has ability to increase its functions we have to use this superpower of kidney in each and every kidney failure patient. Let me show you some examples as you can see there is a drastic decrease the level of creatinine within a short period of time this all happened because in this patient with the help of care of KRFT we have improved the functions of the kidney. Now you might be thinking what is KFRT stands for kidney function restoration treatment. I'll explain this later in this video, but before that you have to understand importance of diet in kidney failure treatment. Diet plays 50% role in kidney failure treatment, with the help of diet you can control levels of creatinine, urea effectively. Whatever we eat affects our body directly or indirectly. Suppose a CKD patient take lots of protein in form of red meat, eggs, cheese, pulses, then level of creatinine will increase, reason is that. Creatinine is a protein waste produced by the muscle during muscle metabolism. If a kidney patient consumes protein more than body needs, extra protein will be converted into creatinine in muscle, resulting in elevation of creatinine value. So it's advised to all kidney patient to avoid all kind of protein, so that creatinine level can be controlled. Now let's talk about urea. Urea is waste, produced by liver, during food digestion, to stop urea formation, we can't stop food intake, because it impractical, but with some dietary modification, we can control its production. If a person take heavy digestible food items like fat, oil, cheese, red meat, liver has to work a lot to digest that, resulting in abnormal production of urea in body, which will reflect in KFT reports eventually. That's why diet is important. Now diet in CKD is a vast topic, it hard to explain it in single video, at the end of this video I'll provide link to my video regarding diet. But as I promised earlier I'll explain KFRT, KFRT is herb based system in which firstly we have to work on the cause of kidney failure and bring that in control as I told you earlier. Once the damages comes in control by increases kidney function can be easily brought down, as we have seen in reports on other patient. Now lots of patient thinks that they are already taking some treatment why they need another, pick up your prescription start searching each and every medicine on Google, you will find medicine for UBP or sugar, phosphate binder, calcium vitamin D, 
but not a single medicine for kidney. Or for improving kidney's function, that's why even after taking medicines for years, levels of creatinine and urea kept increasing, because no one has worked on it. This is not because your doctor don't want to, it is because, till now no medicines has been developed for it. Not even to stop degradation of kidney, restoration of functions of kidney is something which is far away. So, stop worrying about what happened in the past, start working on your blood pressure and blood sugar, bring them in control, and for that do whatever is necessary. If you need our assistance, you can directly call our doctors. Our numbers are flashing on your screen. I hope this video was useful for you. If you still have any doubts, you can drop your questions in the comments section or call my team. I will see you in the next video with new information. Till then, you stay healthy and happy. Thank you so much for watching.